Hi guys, uh, 74 Mafia represents good news everyone, uh, we do have brand new commercially made Bulgarian magazines uh, for the 74 uh, on the market and uh, I'm using those magazines uh, since uh, probably October the last uh, year. So they are pre-coronavirus <laughs> and I have to tell you that uh, they work really, really uh, well. This is the newest uh, generation of uh, those uh, magazines. They do have uh, metal reinforcements and uh, let me show you what I have found out. So of course <laughs> it's, a, it's a floor plate, right? But uh, who cares about that? But then there you go. This is the locking log. That's what it is inside that polymer and all these are included uh, as well on the back of the magazine and then the feeding lips on the magazine as well. So these are steel made parts which are dipped into the or covered in that polymer. So that caught my attention uh, when I was first time exposed to those magazines. And then I started using them. Uh, as you know, I love uh, my 74 rifles uh, very much. And uh, I had a very positive experience. But you do have uh, tons of questions about those magazines. So today I want to quickly show you. I did assemble the Saiga 74, uh, which is of course, you know, the old uh, import. Then I got the... US made built on the uh, Arsenal parts, parts kits uh, from Arsenal Bulgaria. Then there is of course a Vapor 74 and last but not least uh, the 104 FR which is uh, you know like a white crow right now on the market. But uh, I have, I think that's a good representation uh, and let's see how those uh, magazines uh, work in those uh, rifles. So first Saiga and it's a very good lock. No, wobble, no excessive wobbling or anything. Remember wobbling is okay on AK rifles. That's absolutely normal. But as you can see, nothing is happening here. Let me put it around in the chamber. Let's do the few shots. Okay, so it's feeding nicely. I'm going to keep cycling that magazine through all the other rifles. So you know the drill, right? Let's not waste any rounds. The ammo is precious these days. <laughs> okay. All right, now the US made, basically 74. Again, not bad fit. This is the Nodak receiver, not bad fit. There is some wobbling, but nothing excessive. Round in the chamber, it will be a little bit louder. All right, still good. There you go. Let me clear the chamber again. Let's save the ammo. <laughs> Putting ammo back to the magazine. Let's go to the Vepper. And uh, Vepers uh, were brought, like this is the Vepper uh, 74 uh, FM, which, uh, as you guys remember, was imported by the Fime Group. So uh, these were really nice. Uh, and uh, th this is one of my favorite 74s. Uh, so again, tight, but not bad fit. There is some wobbling. Very, very, very slight one. Let's see. Round in the chamber. Okay. Ooh, I love shooting this rifle. Okay, again, let me clear the chamber. Boom, some weeds are collapsing, but that's okay. Putting ammo back to the magazine. And uh, the 104 FR, as I said, white crow at this point. And again, nice tight fit into the magazine. Well, no wobbling. That's a little bit tighter than on the Vepper. And nothing. All right. So, as you can see, chamber is clear. As you can see from all cycling through the old rifles, uh, those magazines work. And as I said, I'm using them since October uh, last year and uh, they are really, really cool. I think it's a great alternative to the surplus magazines because their prices, of course, went to the roof. 
Uh, these are still at the very acceptable price, uh, way, way below uh, 20 bucks per magazine. And uh, you have uh, you have reinforced magazine with uh, the, the steel inserts and uh, they work really, really great. That's why I decided to put them to our uh, AKRU store because I love 74 and I will do everything to promote those little bastards. <laughs> so there you go, guys. Uh, let me know if you have any questions. We, you will see those magazines uh, probably all the time when finally the Palmetto State Armory, Armory will release their 74 will run it, uh, those magazines uh, on that rifle. And uh, also when the Riley Defense will get back um, on their 74, we'll put more and more these into the service uh, for the 5,000 rounds. So this is it. Uh, thanks for watching. And as I said, if you have any questions, post them underneath of the video. Thank you.